welcome back to Amber's Aspect. I'm Amber Nicole, and this week I'm going to be trying out some easy Halloween treats because I see videos online that say easy Halloween treats. So we're going to test it out and see if they actually are easy. So well, let's get started. I wanted to do something fun this week because I know last week was kind of depressing and I actually wanted to say thank you all to everybody who reached out. Um, I'm feeling so much better. I'm uh, trying to stay positive and upbeat so this is what we're gonna do and since it's the first week of October I wanted to have fun now I am NOT in any way shape or form a baker or a pastry chef I feel like I manage <laughs> so we will see how these treats turn out okay so we're gonna be making a spider web cake and then we're going to make some fun little cute Rice Krispie Treat pumpkins and I'm so excited and I really hope they turn out okay because if not then you're just going to see me struggle in this video. <laughs> so as you can see I've already made a mess behind me but it's alright. So for our spider web cake we're going to need marshmallows, um, obvi cake, yes I baked it last night and the Sorby Sweets herself told me that you bake the cake the night before and then wrap it in saran wrap and leave it overnight sitting on the counter. Don't ask me what that does. I don't know, but I listened to the cake lady because she is the cake lady. So, shout out to Sorby Sweets for giving me some tips. Also, you're going to need buttercream. I already made the buttercream, so we need black buttercream. And I don't have the color black, so we're just going to mix all these colors together and hopefully it comes out black. Oh, and also you're going to need this spinny table things. I don't know what it's called, but yeah, it spins and just helps you frost the cake butter. I use one of these to level out the frosting and then this cool thing right here. So let's decorate this cake. Cake, so it's really no big deal. 
So I'm gonna let the cake chill in the fridge for maybe about an hour. So that way it's, this is gonna sound really wrong, but that way it's nice and stiff. <laughs> oh my God. So that way it's nice and stiff and once we put the marshmallows on, it won't be moving all over the place. So I'm gonna let it chill and while that's happening, I'm going to attempt to make the other treats. So for our next Halloween treat, we are going to make little cute ghost cookie things. You'll need Milano cookies, candy melts, and some black icing so we can draw the cute little face on it. These candy melts suck. Okay. We need to figure this out. I don't like this. These are about to be a no-go for me. Hey, what? The video made it look so easy. <laughs> this is not working out. <laughs> this is terrible. This is not easy. <laughs> they're supposed to be ghosts. And they're not. They're like little struggling people. <laughs> oh wait, there you go. Okay, we're in business, kind of. All right, all right. I mean, I'm probably making it more difficult than it should be, but. I feel like that's the best that's gonna happen. <laughs> There's a reason the lady used a fork but I broke the first cookie because I shoved a fork in it and it broke. Oh no, okay, so. So those were my first ones, okay. And these are my last ones where I kind of sort of figured out the candy melts. This is stupid. I'll let those cool off and then we'll draw faces on them in a bit. Our next treat is little witch fingers. So for this, you need pretzels, candy melts, and then almond slices. So I'm going to make this green. I should go on the show Worst Bakers of America. Is there like a worst baker competition? Because I feel like I need to be on it because this is pretty bad. <laughs> Oh no, it doesn't fit. <laughs> oh no, what do I do? Here, let's break that down. I should have made it greener. Guys, I'm struggling. <laughs> on this week's Amber's aspect, Amber's a hot mess again. No! This is so bad. I feel like I should be showing you what I'm doing. Okay, then you have a better view of what I'm doing. Why did I do this? This is stressing me out. Maybe I should have gotten more candy melts. Maybe that's my problem. I didn't get enough candy melts. Ooh, this one looks creepy. This is terrible. I'm so glad I told you that I was not very good at this in the beginning because had I been confident, I would have looked real stupid. <laughs> cool! <laughs> oh man. Okay, so those are my little witch fingers. Fun! I don't know why I did this. I'm like really stressed out because <laughs> I'm wanting to like fix everything, but yeah, no, this is not fun. Just kidding, it is. Now I'm going to put the little faces on our little ghosts. Well, I guess this one gets eyebrows. <laughs> oh no, this is terrible. Can you imagine if I was making these for like Addie's class or something, they would all make fun of her and be like, dude, your mom's dumb. <laughs> oh, they're kind of cute. And now we're going to make our Rice Krispie treats. 
I'm stressed out and I really feel like decorating stuff should not be stressful. <laughs> For our next treat, I'm going to make Rice Krispie Pumpkins. So this one was super cute. I really hope these work out because they just looked adorable. So you're gonna need marshmallows, Rice Krispie cereal, M&Ms, and also orange food coloring. You're basically just gonna make, like you're going to make Rice Krispies, except you're gonna put orange food coloring into the marshmallows and the butter, okay? So let's do it. So I made my Rice Krispies and I feel like I should have put more orange, but whatever, it's fine. So I've got my cooking spray, and so the girl like put cooking spray on her hand, grab them, and then we just form them into little balls. because honestly, I'm like really stressed out. <laughs> I was gonna make one more, but I don't even want to. I wasn't like, this is how you make this. No, I was just seeing if they were as easy as they looked. And maybe I'm just really bad at being a pastry chef, but it was not easy, okay? Five easy treats for Halloween. Yada, yada, yada. So far, what's been easy are these little ball thingies. These are working out pretty good. I really don't like the orange. I should have definitely put more food coloring, but. Obviously, I already got like the test batch out of the way. 
so i know what i did wrong and i know what to fix next time however that was stressful but yeah i am never going to make four types of treats again all in one day because that was extremely stressful and yeah no i feel like it's not terrible but i would not sell these or maybe the pumpkins i'd give them away yeah the other ones are kind of not all that great so i know what i did wrong i know what to fix and i know what to do next time but thanks so much for watching my video um it was a lot of fun if you haven't already go ahead and like this video and subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell if you want to get notified every time i upload a video but i'll see you guys next week bye You like it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Do you like it? Yeah. Is it good? Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Why does this one look so surprised? I don't know, but I don't have eyebrows. <laughs> I know. That was a good rice krispie treat. <laughs> really? Yeah. On God, I didn't tell Missy any of No, I saw him, Cameron. Yeah. <laughs> you suck. <laughs> Is that was a good ass rice krispie treat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. Wasn't a complete fail.